Yo, what's going on, my people? Or how I like to say, what's going on, kings, queens, and phenomenal beings, man. Uh, day 38, man, is Coach T here, your recidivism specialist and re-entry coach on my own personal journey from felon to phenomenal. I call it a mini journey in 2024 because I've done the big work in 2014 but i feel like the journey from felon to phenomenal is a lifelong commitment because you have to deal with the struggles and the stigmas that come with it in life and also internally you have to decide at each moment who's going to show up you know is it going to be your your felon mindset or your phenomenal mindset so day 38 been off for a little bit but i've been busy man been going since saturday saturday had a show in florida i posted sunday came back had a 10-hour dj day i had a six-hour gig then a four-hour gig that's fresh off the plane uh then monday and tuesday i helped uh my boo move and mondays is usually my office days where i get caught up you know i can i can kind of plan out my week but you know i use that to help my boo so I haven't been able to slow down, been back at, at, at work, you know, uh, for those of you who don't know, I help my buddy who owns a landscaping company. Uh, so I cut grass during the week, but also help him on the business side with all the information that I've learned and I pass it on to him as he continues to grow and build it. And also we hire people, uh, we hire people that I work with, you know, through Felton Phenomenal as well uh if you're in houston we in and, and you can get to the humble and atasca city area you can hit me up you know um the season is about to pick up and get busy and we may be looking for some uh more help but i want to with all of that going on i've had some grand enlightening and empowering moments within myself this has been very transformative um because with even all the good there has been some bad um speaking of one of the three areas that i'm focused on in this hundred days uh my health i failed myself i failed myself real bad sunday you know working and djing and i remember seeing a post and it, and it really hit me in my shana na <laughs> like my boy willie mo jr saying hit me in my shana na but it was like be careful of you know drinking and smoking because as a dj those are hazards to the workplace and sunday with 10 hours of djing you know i partook in you know drinking alcohol and and hookah and things like that and it's like okay the alcohol i've, I've definitely managed but i haven't completely stopped to be honest but then i'm having hookah at one spot and then another spot and that's two hookahs in one day and I mean, I don't know if y'all watch the news or the other things and the results that are happening to people in their lungs and stuff. And I was just like, man, so you got to stop, man, because even though I'm celebrating 20 years of DJing, this is the kind of energy I've been working with for 20 years, you know? You have an energy drink or you, you have a couple of drinks and you, you have a couple of smokes and you vibe out, you have a good time. And it's just like, man, I'm getting older and... I can't be doing my body like that. You know, you have to give your body rest. Like they always talk about detox, detox, detox. It's not so much of what you put in 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 your body as far as to help you detox. It's like, what are you eliminating? Like sometimes it's always we want to put more, put more. It's like sometimes we have to push things out. We have to uh, uh, eliminate and go without for a standard amount of time. So I'm not going to lie, you know, struggling, smoking, some 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 days are better than others some weeks are better than other but it's still the mission it's still the goal and that just opened up my mind in a sense about how serious i need to get as i continue you know on my journey uh from felon to phenomenal this hundred day challenge of pushing myself and yeah that's it on that oh uh, what else i got oh man i cannot wait I am so excited. When this 100 days is over, I'm going to show y'all what I've been working on. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm going to show y'all what I've been working on. Yeah, I was going to say, maybe if I get it done earlier, but nah. 
it's gonna be a grand reveal, man. So uh, stay tuned. Appreciate y'all for rocking with me. Shout out to everybody who be supporting and tagging me. Get out of here.